Okay, welcome back everybody. We're doing 1.12, converting the following positive denary numbers into 8-bit binary numbers in the 2's complement format. And we're going to be converting the following part 2, convert the following binary numbers written into 2's complement format into positive denary numbers. Well, okay, that's great. Um, none of these are actually going to give us a, a negative number, and that's what 2's complement is all about. I will show you. So we'll start with the um, with part one. I'm just going to move this out of the way down here, and we'll take a couple of these numbers. I'm going to start with A. So let me grab a pen. Okay, so we've got 39. So if I write it in two's complement, basically it means if it's eight bits as well, eight bit two's complement. I'm going to go one, two, four, eight, sixteen. 32, 64, and 1, 2, 8. But this time, this becomes a minus number. This is what the 2's complement's about. This becomes a minus number. And in the next task, you'll see why. But in this one, it's just straightforward. So, for example, if I was to convert 39, 39 would be um, 1 lot 32, and, of course, we've got 7 added onto that to give us 39, which would be that. And that would remain 0 to say we're not going to introduce a minus number to this. So 39 would equal 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1 in two's complement binary. Okay? I'll do another one. So it's, it's exactly the same as we've done, done in the past. Let's do another one. Okay, if I take F, 125, 125, we've got no, nothing in there. We've, sorry, let me write this down. 1, 2, 5, because we might have to do some sums. Um, one of those, one of those, so that's 96. What have we got left? 25, 29. One of those, 13 left, one of those, 5 left, one of those, none of those, and one of those. So 64, 32, 16, 8, 4, 1 should, if we add them all together, give us the answer 125. Take that. And finally, 56, nice and easy. 56, obviously we've got, again, none of those. None of those, one of those, one of those would give us 48. One of those, none of those, none of those, none of those. 32 plus 16 plus 8 equals 56. As I say, task 1.13, this will become clear, but this is just introducing you to using two's complement. This is there to confuse you, don't worry. It's redundant at this moment in time, certainly for these numbers. Let us rub this out. So convert the following binary numbers written in two's complement into a positive denary format. Well, again, you can see down, if I grab a pen, you can see down here that all of these are zero and are not going to affect and are not going to turn any numbers into negative numbers. That's what this is. So I'll do a few of these and we can see we're just adding things up. 64 plus 16 would equal... 70, 80, 84, 85 for that one, for A. Um, e, let's do that one, easy one. 8 plus 4 is 12, plus 2 plus 1, obviously that one is 15. And if we do the bottom one, J, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4. We've got 64 plus 32, 64 plus 32, plus 16, plus 8 equals 80 equals 120. Dead easy. They're all positive. Everything's good. Let's check the answers. I think we've got those right. Look, 85, 15, and those. I'm just going to bring this back into the screen. So there we go. There are your answers. Have a little look, check through them, just make that a bit smaller. 
have a little look, check through and make sure you are correct. Thank you very much indeed for watching and I will see you next time for 1.13.